Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Pocket Edition. This is Dallas here. We're here over at the village. And uh, as you can see, a little montage of me getting all the tracks out and all that. <laughs> Let me tell you, my iron supply is gone. Every single bit of it. I think I have one iron block left and that is not good. But that's the whole point of this project, as you guys know. Tell by the title, we're making an iron golem farm today. At least we're going to try to because I haven't completely tested yet whether um the iron spawn i mean the golem spawning actually works yet but we're going to go ahead and build it just in case even if uh they fix it in the future so we're going to be doing a popular design i think we're going to be doing uh the natural big spawner up in the sky with a bunch of doors around it have a bunch of villagers in there um and they're going to make little babies and of course since uh i'm going to have water drainage on the inside and the golems will spawn and we will get iron hopefully they'll burn in lava and stuff and hopefully we'll be able to get hoppers and put them down there so um yeah i gotta go back and get mine carts now and um i'm gonna bring these guys all over here and uh, see what we can do so yeah let's go do that all right who's gonna be our first contestant <laughs> um i think i'm gonna go ahead and uh take all the villagers over there so it'll increase the um, the spawn rate hopefully and I'm not going to completely, like, abandon this village. I think in the future I might grab a couple of them and bring them back over here. And I think we're going to do, like, a, like um, I don't know, like a biome enhancement project where we can make this village much bigger and just have a big section for... What the heck is going on? My control stopped there. <laughs> um, a big section for, like, villagers to live in. Um, you having a fine day in there, sir? <laughs> He's been in there forever, probably. Come on out. I know you want to. No, he likes it. All right. So, this is the hard part. Normally, oh, no, you're stuck in there. Oh, well, looky there. He wanted to go first. <laughs> All right. Well, this guy doesn't want any troubles. All right. So, yeah, I didn't even do any powered rails because I figured it'll be pretty quick like this. And, of course, when we get furnace mine carts, it'll be way easier, of course. But I think this is just going to go all the way. Holy crap, dude. Wait up for me. <laughs> all right. So, um, by the next clip, I think I'm going to try to have them all in there. And then I made a little glass tube. That's what I plan on doing. So, yeah. See you in a second. Okay, I noticed a really annoying bug. Um, there's a glitch where this, like, once he gets going a certain direction, he cannot stop going that way. No matter if you get in front of him or nothing. Um, even when you destroy a track, I, like, put a block here and he was against the track. I mean, against the block. And then I removed the block and he continu still continued going that way. And I'm afraid, I'm trying to turn the minecart around here. He, like, he's still stuck going that way, like there's a bug. So I cannot get him to get back on this track no matter what I do. Yeah, see? And then he continues going this way. It's a ridiculous bug. I don't know how I'm going to get all these guys over here. And I can't push him back the other way. I guess I'll have to reset the minecart. I don't know. Um, and then he goes running. Crap, that ain't good. All right, I need you to get back over here, pal. Um, or unless, was he controlling the minecart? I don't think he was. All right. Um, <laughs> and if you guys remember the Ultra Hard, or the Underground Castle, I don't know why I was saying Ultra Hardcore, Underground Castle series, all of our villagers despawned, but I'm not sure if they fixed that bug yet or not. So I'm really hoping... <sighs> I'm really hoping they did fix it. All right, I'm going to try not to lose my mind doing this. You Go away. <laughs> All right. Be right back. All right. So I decided to build it over here next to our greenhouse, kind of in this area. Um, I decided I'm going to go ahead and build the, or the iron golem farm first before I bring all the villagers over. It would just kind of help out because I don't want to bring them all right here and then have to bring them into this. So, um, yeah, this design I'm making, um, I learned this design a long time ago when I used to play, like, xbox version when it first came out and uh i kind of just always did the same design I, I learned it from some guy on youtube a long time ago and uh i'm just gonna go with it again <laughs> um and i need lava i think wait let's go over here to this chest real quick all right i don't know if you guys remember but <laughs> these are our first chests like in this world and uh there's still the original stuff in them like some stuff like that was the clay i was going to use to build this house just some random stuff here and there. Um, I know, there they are. <laughs> These lava buckets. Oh, man. Oh, 
forget all that snow. Um, these lava buckets were actually going to be used right here for some of you that I didn't know. For I have a mob spawner way underground, like a, a manual mob spawner. Well, not manual, like a self built mob spawner. They would travel up through here, go through my house. And they were going to burn right here, but I didn't realize I had made my house out of a lot of wood. So it didn't really work out. Um, but now we can use it over here. I make, <laughs> I'm kind of trying to make this thing look good out of these building materials, which is not going to work out too well. Um, I'm just going to have to experiment with it because I would like to use wood, but I'm just, I don't know. It's kind of far away, so I, I can experiment with it with some lava and whatnot because as of right now, it looks very weird, but uh, it's going to have a huge structure on top of it. You guys will see how it turns out. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and try to finish the whole thing. And uh, yeah, <laughs> I was trying to think if I should or not. Um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and finish the whole thing and see where we can go from there just to save some time. Um, you know, might update you guys here and there, so <laughs> be right back. So, she is almost finished. <laughs> um, actually, now that I think of it, I wish I could have used another door instead of these oak ones because they're kind of not the greatest color. But I read somewhere that other doors don't seem to work because villages naturally spawn with oak doors, so I didn't want to risk it. I just used oak doors. Um, I kind of put some wood accents around it, which I think turned out really well. Um... Yeah, <laughs> I, I still got to add another layer. Um, this in here, I think I'm going to use this for the future of the storage, if it is good. Like, if this thing actually works well. I might add some storage in here, of course, when redstone comes out. Um, and um, I think I might add another layer because... Let's see here. Oh, yeah, I am adding another layer because it adds efficiency, of course. I need to add another one right here on top of that. It's basically going to be the same thing as this as you can see it's pretty basic um put a lot of torches in here so other mobs don't spawn and yeah and these villagers still seem to be here um they haven't despawned i'm surprised they haven't created a baby yet considering i got doors away up there but maybe they have to be closer um so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and finish the whole thing now and after that <laughs> gotta start the process of moving these guys up here i think i want to have four pods on each side except for the front so on all three sides with the villagers inside so because i'm thinking i want to create an iron golem face right here <laughs> that'd be pretty cool um so yeah again i'll see you guys in a second i decided to take a break and chill out in my hot tub isn't this just so peaceful Let's just stay here for the rest of the episode. What do you guys say? We can do that. But we have an iron golem farm to finish, so we can't, sadly. <laughs> I'm over here at the Mesa Biome, um, and I have been mining my absolute tits off over here. Uh, I got so much clay now. Well, actually, not that much, actually. Just a bit to hold me off. I also grabbed some white clay. Um, so I think I might use this for the iron golem's face. I'm not for sure, but who we, I am tired of mining. <laughs> I kind of just want to get this project finished now. And, um, yeah, <laughs> so basically all I have to do now is get all the villagers uh, over there and, um, what else? Uh, put the iron golem face on and then see if she works, which I'm 
kind of scared it's not going to. I just have a feeling Pocket Edition is weird like that. So, um, yeah. <laughs> Let's go finish her up. All right. Um, sorry if you hear <laughs> that noise in the background. I always mention this. Like, It is like five degrees where I'm at right now. And I, I usually wait for my furnace to turn off to start recording because it leaves that fuzzy noise in the background. But... It just won't turn off and it gets so cold. So um, I'm sorry, but you guys are just gonna have to put up with it. I hate it, but that's whatever, I guess. I wanna go ahead and wrap up this episode and finish up this thing because it is dragging along quite far today. Um, I came up here for some hardened clay. Oh, is that black? It's gray. Wait, I still might be able to use that though. I need black stained clay. Now, how am I going to get that? Okay, you need ink sacks. I don't think I have any of those, though. Dang it. Where? I don't know where to... F <laughs> There's never any squids anywhere where I know where to find them. Um, I'm all out of coal now, too, I think. Oh, I got a few pieces. I'm trying to use a black color because... Let's see here. Because I'm trying to make the pixel art for the <laughs> iron golem. I almost have them done. Plants. I just need red now for his eyes. There we go. That'll work. All right, let's go finish him up real quick. Hope I remember how to do it. Crap. I can't quite remember the face. I thought I'd memorize it, but I don't think I will. Um, let me just go show you what I got done so far. I was deciding either between a pixel art of an iron golem's face or a pixel art of an iron bar. I haven't tried out the iron bar yet, but after looking at this, I kind of like this. As you can see, it turned out just fine. Normally, he has more detail on his face, but I went for the more simplistic look. Um, just kind of all white kind of his bags under his eyes it looks like now these are the correct colors so far let's go ahead and finish this up have some extra clay in here okay so let's go go ahead and do his mono brow he has a large brow oh crap oh wait no I think I grabbed enough all right we're good <laughs> you ready for your brow <laughs> you got a big nose why not just throw a brow on it to make it even worse? All right, yeah, I think this will be a good color for the brow. Just like that. And then he has, let's go ahead and throw those right there. Oh crap, does white go there? I'm just gonna do that for now. Now down here, I think he has, let's go ahead and craft two of those. Oh no, I need to go back down. If I remember correctly, I think he, both of the red of his eyes, it's kind of like my slime eyes. See how I have uh, two by two, one, oh, it's kind of hard to explain, I'll just show you. <laughs> All right, crafting table, two of those will look red enough. These guys are still in here, surprisingly, too. Don't worry, I'll get you guys out. I know it kind of sucks living with a, a cow and a pig, but... Get used to it. Because <laughs> you guys are going to be all crowded soon in these little pods, which I still got to make. And I still got to bring all the villagers over here. Oh, man. Okay. Oh, crap. I did... <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> um, I was going to make coal blocks. I don't th Oh, I've... <sighs> guys, I'm tired. Just ignore me right now. What I was talking about is he has red eyes, I think, in the bottom corners like that. And then these are black. So I think I'm going to have, go have to collect some coal. <laughs> I'm literally all out of coal. And then see how this looks. I want to take a step back and look real quick. Yeah, that looks weird. I guess it'll look normal when we're done. I don't know. Alright, let me go finish it real quick. I found the jackpot. <laughs> I have... Well, I found like almost a stack of coal down here and another stack that unmined coal. I forgot all about these chests down here. We have a lot of good stuff in here, such as more clay down there. Just uh, random materials in here. And then I even forgot about this chest in here. We really need to work under down here because this place is cool. Um, yeah. Oh, Give me that. I don't even have a, I don't even have a shovel on me. All right, I'll take that. Um, yeah, this place is a mess. We kind of just forgot about this. Oh, we got so many projects. I could have used obsidian for the black on them, but it's just a little bit, has a little purple tint to it, and I didn't think it looked nice. Um, so let's go throw these on him and see if it looks nice. 
I looked back at the like a, a picture of an iron golem, and it is correct. His eyes, the red part of his eyes, kind of do drift off to the side like that for some reason. I guess he's like a derpy person. All right, we just need three more of those. Just six of them. Nice. Let's finish this real quick because I can barely hold my eyes open. It's like two in the morning. All right, and then I want to fix this as well. I think. I need to lower this one by one, I think. Throw these in here. You're gonna look beautiful, buddy, don't worry. And then, I think I wanna bring his nose out one more. I'm just gonna test it. And I can't remember if I, go, I should go down one. Like that. Oh, <laughs> what a, okay, no. The nose needs to go back a little bit because it kind of gives the illusion as if it's more of a cartoon look. <laughs> Sorry. Gosh dang it, Dallas. Alright, let's take that. Take a step back. Yes! Yeah! <laughs> That's what I like. Now that looks like an iron golem. I like how that turned out. I'm going to have to slab off the top of his head there, sadly, though, because I don't want any golems spawning up there. Oh, yes. I like that. <laughs> The doors kind of look like he has some big ears, but I, I like how it turns out. <laughs> Turned out. Um, now, I think I need to create pods something like this on this side. And this, all three sides except for the iron golem side. And once I get all the villagers in there, then we should test if this farm will actually work in our world. All right. So I got a lot to do. Be right back. <laughs> Alright guys, uh, I am sorry, but we are going to go ahead and call it an episode today. I know I'm kind of leaving it at a cliffhanger, but um, it's basically done. But I'm going to, at the start of next episode, we're going to see if it works. So, obviously, you're going to have to stay tuned to see that. <laughs> Which will be either today or the next day. Um, but let's go ahead and do the question of the day. The question of the day comes from... Ghost1221 Casper, can you start live streaming? Um, well, I did used to live stream on Mob Crush. I did like a lot, a few times. My account's still on there with uh, some a few live streams on there. Um, I I was into it for a little bit, but I'm just honestly not the live streaming person, guys. Uh, I'm more of just a YouTube person that just likes scheduled uploads on just rant. Well, <laughs> not necessarily scheduled, but uh, just uploads on YouTube. Um, Maybe I might get into it in the future again, but as of right now, I won't be live streaming anytime soon. I'm sorry. It's just I barely have time to put out these videos now. And knowing that thinking about live streaming just isn't an option for me right now. Uh, sorry. Um, but yeah, that's the truth, though. Another question comes from Baller3. And he asks, favorite hermit on hermit craft? And he said, assuming if I watch it. And he also stated that uh, item frames will not have lag, and I did hear of that, um, saying that they will have the properties of signs, um, which is true, but then again, I heard signs also, if you have a lot of them in a world, signs do kind of cause like a little bit of lag, um, I heard about that from something, um, and that's why I assumed item frames might, I just said that it wouldn't really help having more item frames, but, um, your question, who's my favorite hermit, uh, I do watch Hermitcraft, actually. I haven't watched it lately, but my favorite hermit on there... Well, I don't have... I don't know, it's hard. Obviously, my favorite's probably Etho. He's always been my favorite YouTuber uh, back in the day. I've actually started trying to watch him again because he he's kind of in, the guy that inspired me to get into Minecraft. Um, uh, who else? <laughs> uh, the other two I kind of like is DocM77. He's always been kind of my favorite other Minecraft YouTuber. He hasn't been uploading a whole lot lately, though. hes I mean, he has been, but not Minecraft. Um, and my other favorite one that's on the Hermitcraft server has probably got to be... Jeez, I don't know. I like all of them, guys. Uh, if I had to pick another one, Mumbo Jumbo's all right. Um, but I also like Exazuma. Uh, those are probably my top four or five. <laughs> um, but yeah, I kind of... Ethos, he, Ethos got his own, like, unique style, and that's what I like about him. And he's got me into Minecraft, as I just said. But, yeah, that's that, guys. If you want your question to be answered, 
type QOTD in the comments and then your question, I mean, and uh, I might answer it. So thank you guys for watching as always. Thank you for dropping a like. You guys have been destroying that lately and it's amazing. And thank you for you if you are still watching. Type, type, uh, type, uh, fancy golem in the <laughs> comments if you're still watching. <laughs> I like seeing who is still watching. <laughs> I don't know. I care about the fans who still watch to the very end. Alrighty, guys. <laughs> thank you for watching. Oh, my furnace came on. Worst timing. <laughs> and bye-bye.